All right, so welcome back to another episode, and today we're actually out here throwing a Z-Man Finesse TRD on a 1 10th ounce Finesse Shrooms Ned Rig Jig Head. I got a Shimano Stratic CI4 Plus 3000 FA, uh, 6 foot 10, medium power, extra fast action, Shimano Corrado spinning rod, 15 pound braid to an 8 pound fluorocarbon leader. Gonna try and make a one fish video. Whether it be a bass or a largemouth bass, a smallmouth bass, or a pike, one big fish would be would be a cool video, and I got one. Molly. Boom. First fish of the day. And that is a decent one. Oh yeah. Probably a probably a high one pound. Awesome fish, man. Gorgeous. Especially here in November. Go ahead and turn that on. Get the scale on there and clear it. I'm gonna say, I don't know, two pounds even. You got one pound, 14. One pound, 14 ounces. All right. Go ahead and get that fixed. Go up on the drag a little bit. I didn't expect to be talking about it to, like as I was talking about it, it happened. So keep going, see if we can't get another one or two. I did. Got another one. Gotta wear them out. Got him. Second one of the day. I think we got a few stacked up right there. That's a fat one. Gotta switch angles though. Look at the colors on that fall, Smalley. Man, gorgeous fish. I bet you that one's close to as big as the first one. Look at that. Just the way he fought. Go ahead and clear it. Just the way he fought, what do we got here? One pound, I thought it was close, one pound 12. One pound 12 ounces. Not as long, but definitely a fatter fish. Oh yeah.
All right, go ahead and get the scale put away. And like I said, with that Ned rig that I'm fishing, I know I went over the stuff, but I'm gonna have to, it's just a green pumpkin finesse TRD. I do like that braid to fluorocarbon or straight fluorocarbon, it really doesn't matter. I'm gonna go right back to the same spot where I just caught the two. What, was that a bite already? Can't be. So one thing that I've done is I've actually taken a lot of tackle out of, out of my bag and I just have like thunder crickets, uh, Strike King, net bait, Guggen plastics, got some jigs. And then I took this little, this tiny little Z-Man bag of the TRD tubes that I had and I put about five or six pre-rigged Ned rigs in there to carry with me, especially because they're in the Z-Man bag. There you go. Like that, the Finesse TRD. It is the green pumpkin color with a one-tenth ounce Finesse Shrooms Ned Rig jig head. I know I already said that once, but that fish that I got at the beginning while talking about it, kind of wasn't expecting that, especially when you know you're doing an intro. And you're like, all right, I'm gonna do this intro and then go to the fishing. Well, that just happened on its own. It's kind of the best way that it happens. But anyway, just got that, throwing that Ned rig. I just got, like I said, chatterbaits, Ned rigs, jigs, and plastics. That's been the majority of my fishing this year. Now, real quick too, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna go over the two bottom baits that I talked about in this video. And by the way, if you're still watching at this point, I do wanna say thank you so much. I know I've been super busy, haven't been uploading as much as I normally do, but the fishing videos, the tackle videos, those are always going to continue. So, the first bottom bait right here is a Strike King Bitsy Bug. This is the green pumpkin color, and this thing is like $2, two-something dollars. And this jig is so effective. I've caught so many largemouth bass and smallmouth bass on this bait this year more than anything with a bait caster. And you'll see it's got a net bait pack a chunk trailer in the green pumpkin color. Another one that I also do like is brown. I thought I might have it here in the box, but I don't. But this little $2 jigs, I mean, this little $2 jig is great. Uh, it catches fish. They're cheap. I usually go to the store and buy five to 10 at a time. Uh, I have used other jigs and bigger jigs to catch fish this year, but this thing right here, this Bitsy Bug, if you don't fish this, check it out because it's going to flat out catch fish. Largemouth bass and smallmouth bass here in Michigan. Right there, you'll see green pumpkin and black and blue. But anyway, you're gonna go ahead, set that down, and move on to the Ned Rig that I fished with in the video, and that is the Z-Man Finesse TRD, and it also is the green pumpkin color. And I do have a little TRD tubes package that I talked about that I, I keep pre-rig Ned Rigs in because if you put them in these, it's not good. I like to keep them in the Z-Man package. But anyway. Go ahead and take one out of the package. I you do I do use a one tenth ounce Ned Rig jig head or a one sixth ounce sixth ounce. Excuse me. This one is not perfectly straight. It's okay. It's not the greatest, but the majority of the time that I fish a Ned Rig, I do keep it perfectly straight. This one right here that I had the, at the top of the pack uh, package, I just kind of threw together and had it in there. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I did, like I said, just want to cover cover the baits that I've been using um that'll probably be the last the last two fish that I catch for the year I'm gonna try and get some ice fishing content and some other stuff never know what I can come up with but anyway like I always say if you enjoy this video do me a favor hit the thumbs up subscribe check out the videos down in the description I believe that I have something for everyone whether that's bass fishing fishing tackle reel reviews you name it vlogs editing basic videos it's all on there. But anyway, 35,000 subscribers and counting. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.